Hey YouTubers, it's Mark from True Seeker, and uh, I'm gonna take a look at something here. I just uh, I it could kind of make sense of what I'm looking at, but I mean it it could be a base, a carving, machinery. Uh, I just don't know. I mean, I, I know there's some manipulation of the photo on uh, JPL or NASA's part, but look at how this looks like a square box, right? With something in front of it that's cut out. Okay, it looks like it's got a little piece coming up. And then there's all types of crazy piping in the background here. You see this center part? When I, where I moved that, there's a center, you can see it, and it's got what looks to be piping and stuff. See how the piping is? Or this is just a statue in the way they make their statues. You can see there's another section here. You can see the details. Here looks to be maybe a, a statue. see that some of this stuff has been hidden but uh, I mean they really darkened this picture up a lot and you know it just there's no real uh, this is just all pixelated there's no resolution now again you see this symbol I found this all over place. There is no way a rock is going to form that symbol perfectly. And not not the many times that I found it. <laughs> I can't even count how many times I found uh, the S. Uh, backwards S. Uh, threes. E's. Backward, you want to say backwards three. Whatever you want to call it. I mean, that's pretty cool to me. Something intelligent had to create that. Unless they're just lucky on Mars with their rocks. The wind and rain and it just creates all this beautiful stuff. You come over here, it looks like there's a little pipe that comes out, a little bend. This section looks to be like another piece of piping coming up. Can you see that? It's pretty clear. I mean, at least to me. I don't know what's going to happen after I upload this. But I've looked at a couple of my videos. I just went back about 10, 15 videos, and uh, one or two of them something happened to them I, I just don't know I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna redo it I think one of them was from Soul 620 and uh, the contrast was just blasted and I remember loading it up and watching it it was pretty cool I watched it a couple of times on my giant screen and now it's just horrendous See like stuff like this, see the shadow underneath it. So it's gotta be raised up. See how this looks like a structure out there? See this thing here? See how this has got legs? 
you could see the legs holding it up in the air. It's got one, two, three, four. This circular item, it looks like it's got windows, is raised up off the ground and you see the shadow underneath it. You see that? This is what I mean with NASA playing with the size. And here's another item. See the shadow right underneath it? These are structures. That's for damn sure. Like this is a pretty cool picture. This should be a picture that the mast cam is taking in full high definition. But we know why this is a low quality. We know better. See all that's going on back here? See how these structures are raised? You see piping. And this looks like another carved out, maybe letter or building. Yeah, this has got two circular balls coming out. They look like tanks standing here upright. This is what I see on my screen pretty clear. See this? Looks like a circle with some type of opening. You see a shadow underneath it. See how this is like a, a structure coming out of the mountain? Then it's got a top section. Then there's another section that comes up here, another circular like pod. And then there's another one, another circular pod. A little pole comes up bent. See how it's got a line coming across, maybe piping or something, something like piping maybe. You see how this is circular, it comes out coming out of the mountain. There's the shadow underneath it. Then you come over here. You see how this statue's raised and it's leaving a shadow. Then you come over to this weird thing. Look at this. Comes around. You see how it's leaving a shadow? It's raised up. And it's got a weird curve in it. And you can see the shadows underneath it. Looks like a piece of, like, maybe, I guess, roller coaster track or something. You know what I mean? I'm not saying it's what it is, but. It's just weird the way it comes up, it's bent, circles around. Here looks to be some type of statue. You see the structure and this stuff back here. These are real things, people. I haven't, I haven't added this to the photo. As always, I'll give you all the links. And you can go right to NASA's website and look at this yourself. And you'll see all of this. 
you'll even see more. You see this structure under here? You see this haze that they put? You see all of this? See, this, this is what they're hiding. Here's a base of it. There's the top of the statue. You see all the shadows. That's what they're hiding. Pretty obvious. You see stuff like this, it looks like a perfect metal ball. See what they blurred out half of? You can see what's going on here. See these statues? I think that showed up pretty good. See the structure of all of this stuff back here? It's got holes in it. Piping coming up out of it. This stuff stands up. Holes coming out of stuff. Which is wild. Just really wild to, you know, when you see this stuff. And to know it's from an original NASA picture, you know. Now, if we're on Mars, that's a whole nother story. See this? It's like a wire or something coming down. You can see the shadow on the rock. There's a shadow right, right on there. This looks like there's trees or some type of growth up here. There looks to be maybe like a little lizard coming out. You see its eye, its arm, or it's a statue. It looks to be maybe like a little lizard just climbing out from a hole in there. Which wouldn't surprise me. There's a lot of life on uh, Mars. I've shown some pictures. You got two eyes and a little bit of a brain. The pictures that I showed you of life on Mars show you some type of fly, worms, cockroaches, cockroach looking type things. And it only makes a lot, it only it just makes sense that all of that stuff would be there. makes some people they feel safe thinking they're elite you know that they're to the top of the food chain there's no other life in the whole universe you know it just it makes some people feel safe in their brain in their mind they feel they just feel safe that way you know anytime you question any of that some people just can't handle it they just like go off the wall you know which is crazy. And then other people, you could talk to them about this stuff. They may have never known about any of this, but I've uh, turned a lot of people on to this kind of stuff. And uh, I'll tell you, most 70, probably 75 to 80% of the people in this world, I feel, have a pretty open mind towards this kind of stuff. That there's life in other planets and it's just not that big of a deal. 
you know, God created everything, God created the universe, and it just makes sense. Why would God waste all that space? It's almost be, it would almost be like you calling God an idiot. <laughs> because all he had to do then was just create this little earth. That's it. And just put it on like some type of spindle, some type of base. And, uh, you know, or you could sit and just spin. So, you know, I'm sure God didn't, uh, you know, you don't want to call God an idiot. He just didn't create the whole universe, or, you know. We had a little extra space. A little extra leg room. No, no, that's not what happened. He had a bigger plan. And he loaded it up with life. And there ain't a thing wrong with that. See how these look like pipes? Now they're coming out and leaving shadows. And Some people say, you know, that the, the Martians live underground. You know, is this some type of underground filtration system? Is this how they get air? Is this how they process water, food? You know, who knows? Alright guys, this is Truth Seeker and I'm out.